The overall goal of this procedure is to co-culture two different organ equivalents, such as liver spheroids with skin models, under physiological flow conditions. This is accomplished by first producing liver spheroids in hanging drop plates and punch skin biopsies. Next, the multi-organ chip platform is fabricated. Then, the multi-organ chip is endothelialized. Finally, the multi-organ chip is loaded with the organ equivalents, connected to the pump control units, and daily medium samples are taken and analyzed for glucose, lactate, and LDH. Ultimately, tissues can be removed from the multi-organ chip and TEER can be measured, and endpoint analyses like qPCR and immunofluorescence can be performed. The main advantage of this technique over existing in vitro single organ cultures is that two organ cultures can be connected by a physiological flow in microchannels which can be endothelialized. Uh, this system can therefore emulate the systemic combination of two organ equivalents. After producing spheroids of HEPA-RG and HH stack cells in hanging drop plates according to the text protocol, there are two possibilities for barrier models. With an incandescent knife, either cut transwells containing ready-to-use skin models below the bracket to prepare 96-well cell culture inserts, or transfer a skin biopsy to an empty transwell. Once the multi-organ chip, or MOC, has been fabricated following the text protocol, Remove the medium from human dermal micro...